As much hardship as the coronavirus pandemic has already caused Oregonians, one community in our state could suffer even more. To prevent an even greater tragedy, the Oregon legislature must provide assistance to laid-off workers without legal status. Immigrants without legal status are essential to Oregon's urban and rural communities. They are our neighbors, classmates, business owners, and our family members. About 86,000 Oregon children live with a family member who lacks legal status. That is one out of every 10 Oregon children. The vast majority of these children, nearly 83%, are U.S. citizens. Immigrant workers provide the labor for key industries such as agriculture, accommodation and food services, and manufacturing. Some of these industries have been devastated by the coronavirus crisis. Workers without legal status typically carry out their work for low pay. As a result, they have few resources to meet their basic needs. Oregonians without legal status pay taxes like the rest of us do. They pay income taxes, payroll taxes, property taxes, and so on. The federal government recognizes that workers without legal status perform essential work in this time of crisis. Even so, workers without legal status are excluded from most social safety net supports. At a time of skyrocketing layoffs, they cannot access unemployment insurance. In late March, Congress enacted a third federal relief package. This legislation extends unemployment insurance to self-employed individuals and other categories of workers normally not covered by unemployment insurance. But it left out immigrant workers without legal status. These immigrant families were also completely cut out of the cash assistance the federal government sent to families. In these circumstances, laid-off workers without legal status will have little to sustain themselves and their families during the period of social isolation and economic crisis. How can we ask immigrant workers to abide by the stay-at-home order and call them essential, while at the same time denying them any income support to help them pay for food and other basic necessities? This is not only cruel, but it undermines the goal of social isolation. The Oregon legislature needs to step up and help fix this wrong. It needs to properly fund the Oregon Worker Relief Fund. The Oregon Worker Relief Fund would provide laid off workers without legal status a wage replacement. This will help them take care of their families during these extremely difficult times. Immigrants without legal status are part of our community. We must help ensure their well being in this time of crisis.